Well, CP time. You like our music selection we had set up? <laughs> that was You Don't Know Nan by <laughs> Trick Daddy and Trina. Man. Man. <laughs> <laughs> this show has been brought to you by Man. Was that the you song that was on? That was the song that oh, was where? on before we came <laughs> on, yes. I just want to see how accurate you were. Beautiful Black Tom's uh, segue. Okay. <laughs> oh, beautiful Black Tom. Booyah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then, <laughs> I sound like a person. You think <laughs> beautiful black time? Yeah. How you think? Uh, Why'd you have to sniff your finger after that? Because <laughs> I was, that was actually like my. I was gonna say, you had to sniff your finger after that beautiful black time. <laughs> he said, he said beautiful black time went. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no. This is this is something you ain't let us know yeah. about. <laughs> no, I was <laughs> actually just <laughs> pausing to think. Oh, and yeah, it yeah. just totally uh, blew my uh, off oh. the spot. I don't know what. You, I don't know what she did. <laughs> <laughs> beautiful. Beautiful black girl. Um, I worry about y'all. I worry about y'all. Hey. Like, like hey. I worry about y'all like I worry about Billboard. Did y'all read that list? Uh, did we? What's on the list? Um, You have it up there? Alright. We're going to pull that list up. Pull that list up. Move something. that bus. I heard Lauren on this, so. She I, is. I I'm, think she's I'm, like number seven, if I'm not mistaken. All right. I'm and the list goes Biggie, Jay Z, Eminem, Rakim, Nas, Andre, 3000, Three Stacks, Lauren Hill, Ghostface Killer, Kendrick Lamar, Lil Wayne. And that is the 10 greatest rappers of all time. And it's only 10 that they put? It's top 10. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's their top 10. Um, Kendrick Lamar and Lil Wayne. I don't know. I'm not knocking Kendrick Lamar at all. Just the newness. Yeah, factor. I don't know if his catalog is is large enough yet to put him up there with those greats just yet. Not saying that he's not great. I I enjoy Kendrick Lamar and I think he's an outstanding performer. But I don't know that he's been out long enough to put him in that mix. Hey, Biggie had two albums. Yeah. But Biggie's two albums, I think, did more for the music. Like, we can, how you, to, to depends on the Depends on how you weigh it, baby. Yeah, but <laughs> how can you Some people was like, oh no, this is. <laughs> but you can't weigh not. the greatest too, like, early. Like, Kendrick is still current and still, like, I could, a lot of people on this list, I could agree with to a degree. Because a lot of them, like, if you look at the way that, they're, like, Rock is saying, their catalog and the way that their impact yeah, overall. Well, Biggie doesn't really have much of a catalog. Yeah, but his impact of his very, his two albums it's great. changed the landscape. I'm not, yes, I'm, 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 no, I'm no, the there's no way am I saying it's not great. Mm -hmm. But Biggie has just as much of a catalog as Kendrick Lamar. But his catalog is done more. I think for music, like Biggie's two albums. Yeah, I don't know. Change rap. I don't Kendrick's, know that Kendrick has shifted. And Kendrick has Biggie's two Biggie's two albums, albums changed like six. Biggie's albums two albums together. changed rap in Biggie's way, but Kendrick's second album actually had a message, which Biggie's albums never really. had. I mean, his second album was starting <laughs> to get a message, though. That sky's the limit. That's one song. Well, I mean, come with the rest. Well, of he's there. coming from the yeah. era though where you had variety. Man, man, you had man. a shoot 'em up. You had a party. You had a posse. Mm -hmm. You had a, a a positive message one. Maybe a reflective joint. You know what I mean? Yeah, but it's still I was all on all standpoints didn't really stand for much. But I'm from the hood. Like this is true. He didn't reach a lyrical maturity yet, which makes sense. I mean. All right, we're talking about Kendrick, which is crazy that they would put Kendrick on here because they left off Tupac. Even though know, Kendrick right. is, he he always mentions he has a track on his last That's album true. that you're saying is makes him could could put him in an argument with the greatest. His last track was most of that was Tupac interview was the Tupac interview. But and even it left him off this list. Of even that Tupac rapper like, of all time. Even that like I wouldn't put Pac ahead of Lauren. No. I, but at the same time, I put him ahead of Lil Wayne. I'd take that much. <laughs> Depends. Put him ahead of Lil I mean, Wayne. I've never heard. I never heard Pac say a punchline. Are, ever. Yeah, yeah. Are we talking so it's like lyrical dexterity. He took a lot of. He took a lot of stuff, but it wasn't like a hey, like show me the whole spectrum. Then, like Pac was a great 
uh, songwriter, I think, overall. Hey, Little Main didn't Drake make a Dear Mama, Mama, but he did make the, the joint about the prom queen. Oh. <laughs> hey, he made prom queen. It is what it is. I mean... <laughs> I don't know. I can't. I just can't. I love Pac. So, I, but I could throw it up. I could throw it up and catch it on either side. Like, I, well, my issue with this list is the fact that my biggest issue with this list is the fact that it's Billboard. I mean, right. So, end of the day, what are the qualifications? What What is it based on? When you think Billboard, you think sales. Uh, not only that. Initially, so when I think Billboard and I think rap, I think. Y'all waited mad long and you excluded them from actually listing on Billboard. <laughs> right. and, you, and when you were given awards, you would wait till commercial breaks to give it to them. So True. why can you now be someone who has the right to make a list? But at the same time, with any type of everyone authority. can make a list. I could ask any random there's, person on the yeah, There's no real relevance in their nah. list aside the fact that it just happened. Like, oh, they made one. Right. But when it comes to when you're saying, like, certain people should be there, certain people shouldn't, I say if, like... From my standpoint, it's Billboard. They're looking at rap. They're not looking at hip hop. They're looking at rap. Who's the best rappers? Like so, that, that's a that's a that's a corporate word. Like well, they've got people in the hood ahead of Rakim. But then who you will miss then? Yeah, I that's mean, amazing. Like I can't never Eminem wouldn't put Eminem in heaven. Rakim. 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 Exactly. Like, like, <laughs> I don't hear G rap. You wouldn't pull an Action Bronson. Where was G rap at? <laughs> Yeah. G rap fathered styles that are yes. on that list. Yes, style fathered. That's the only reason why I say Kendrick and Tupac. Cause I'm like, your father's. Big style. pun ain't on there. Big pun ain't on there. If Kendrick, put it like this, if Lil Wayne and um, Kendrick should be on there, Big Pun should be on there. The big there's there's, there's, there's no way, on. there's no way Kane and Pun and G rap ain't on that list. But then again, we're not talking about rappers. We're talking about, I mean, we're not talking about hip-hop. We're talking about rappers. Like, but, I mean, weird, I, they they there Rock are Kim. lyricists on here. KRS-One is not on there. They have Rakim. No, but that's the thing. And he's not really a seller, especially during the Billboard era of rap. Exactly. See, my thing is this. If they're going to talk about selling, then where is Vanilla Ice? Where is MC Hammer? Where's PM Dawn on this list? Right. But, but that's Dawn the thing. Not- you have to have both. <laughs> You have to actually be able to spit and sold records, is what they trying to okay. say. Okay. Mm-hmm. So do you think, see, did that? Because the thing is, Rakim, like, I, his sales, one of my favorites, but his sales. I mean, he's gone that, gold. He's gone gold. Yeah. Which at the time he did go gold was the equivalent of going platinum nowadays. Rakim is sure. on everybody's list. So for yeah. the fact, for, for them to not put Rakim, they would look real yeah, bad. Yeah, they would be remiss. Like, look, they would like, all right, we could not put G-Rap and still put Rakim, right? We could not put Kane and right, still right. put Rakim. I think that's how, Kane, how they right. rationalize it. They're like, let's pick the best from that era. How you going to put Hove and not put Kane? Yeah. Are you gonna put a hole in up with Jazz? No, I'm just kidding. Oh! <laughs> Shots Shots bleak at Shots in this equation. <laughs> he don't fit. <laughs> Where the range is? <laughs> Man, bleak is like Dolomite. <laughs> <laughs> Rudy <Really> made more. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sit down with the little rage. Dignified right. monkey. <laughs> <laughs> he said, like, get off my feet. <laughs> Nah, um, I appreciate the fact that Andre 2000 didn't make it. Yeah. But you can't, like, come on, like, lo- the, the love below? The problem For is, real? how do you get there's no, yeah. there's no way somebody could get past the love below, dog. That changed music. It's true. That's For, true. For a hip hop artist, that and changed music. That's what it most likely like, should be based on. Uh, people who have shifted. Yeah, it's the climate change. But then you know who's upshifted? Who's gauging it, though? Me and you, you're black. Tom. Yeah, yeah, it don't matter what they say. <laughs> so, all right, all right, so this is what we're going to do. This is, what is the really black town. We are the equivalent Tom of the barbershop. The black town top ten. What would you say is the black town explosion? We will have that for you next week. <laughs> no, we're going to have that when we come back from commercial break if we got wow. commercials. <laughs> <laughs> the pressure is on. <laughs> wow. But it would have to be a top 20. It wouldn't be. I couldn't do a top 10. Got to do a top yeah. 10. That's that's the, that's the, the rubric. Right there. My, like, my, my 10 rubric. doesn't. It's, it's, it's the syllabus. My, my 10 don't leave late 80s, early 90s. So, so, so my yeah. so my next ten would have to be the other now. people. 
Like, Slick Rick. No, no, no. It, it might not even be now. It might be the other people. <laughs> like, well, um, mid 90s, late, um, early 2000s. <laughs> Whoever makes it to the list makes it to the list. Cameron's not on that list. No. Hey, nah, Slick Rick is on, on that list. list. Cameron. Cameron's on my list. Oh, but you're going to have the ind individual list, huh? You just turned something up loud, didn't you? I didn't turn something up loud. Maybe that was me. <laughs> Black Time Explosion. We, we about to get a list together. <laughs> we gonna get this list together. We gonna get into some music. Uh, I see uh, beef in our future. This is beef. This oh. might be the last Black Time show. <laughs> <laughs> individual show. <laughs> Brown time. We definitely about to have individual list out there. And this is. I'm gonna have light skin time. time. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be light skin time with Don T, baby. <laughs> you know you ain't right. <laughs> Boom. Boom. <laughs>